Ministry of Tourism projected to employ nearly 119 million people in the sector by 2050. And if we see the kind of, uh, therefore, the total contribution in 2019-20 towards employment of tourism came up to 15.34%, which broke into 6.69% of direct jobs and 8.65% of indirect. If we are currently, and I'm not counting the COVID period in because clearly that's been a period of um, some uh, challenging period for the entire world. But we go back to 1920, 5.16%. And if we were to keep growing even at that fixed rate of 5%, look at the potential. You have a potential coming up in terms of employment. If we see the graph on the last part, 2049-50, you're looking at 190 million people being employed by tourism. In 2029 and 30, you're already looking at a reach of 304.5 billion in terms of the GDP contributions. So I think if the, the point that we're trying to drive home here and hard hit is that tourism is not just about building memories, but tourism is about serious growth and serious employment potential. <laughs> Tourism Spain brings an opportunity to know the latest updates on the Schengen visa at its next webinar today at 3 p.m. IATO highlights its key focus areas for recovery. Key focus area is that the, number one is the safety, road to recovery and brand India. We have to focus on brand India. The key is that to send a message across the world that India is safe and we are fully vaccinated and people who are the soldiers in travel and hospitality in the, uh, industry, they are also fully vaccinated. So invite people, invite the fam tours, hold conferences and then open the doors for the whole world. We have also requested to the Ministry of Tourism that all the states should have one policy for India. It's not like that if a person is traveling from Delhi to Rajasthan, he again has to do the RT-PCR or, or traveling to Kashmir or to some other places and doing the test again and again. So we'll make the things simple and straight. If person is fully vaccinated, he should be allowed in all the parts of India. We are holding a convention and we are expecting almost 1500 delegates and that will convey a very good message, positive message, message to the world. So this is number two and we are the one who is making the strategies with the government and uh, planning a lot of things. The Stara starts twice a week non-stop flight service to Paris from Delhi. IRCTC plans Ramayana Yatra train tours to promote religious tourism. India's first four seasons private residences Bengaluru opens door.